Did you know that the United States is one of the most religiously diverse countries in the world? Out of the 330 million people living here, more than 75% identify with some form of religion, whether it be Christianity, Islam, Judaism, Hinduism, or others. But here's the catch. Some states are far more religious than others. In some places, religion is a cornerstone of daily life, while in others, it's fading away. Are you curious about which states hold on tight to their faith and what might be driving that devotion? Let's dive deep into the top 10 most religious states in America. But before we go further, make sure to like, subscribe, and watch till the end to discover some surprising truths about faith in the US. Number 10, North Carolina. In North Carolina, faith runs as deep as the rivers that cut through its landscape. Did you know that 73% of North Carolinians identify with a religious group? A powerful 42% attend church every week, and Christianity dominates the scene with 35% evangelical Protestants, 21% mainline Protestants, and 9% Catholics. But what about the other religions? You will find 2% of the population follows non-Christian faiths, including Islam, Hinduism, and Judaism. Why is North Carolina so religious? Here, it's not just about faith, it's about tradition. Dating back to the colonial era, Christianity was deeply ingrained in the fabric of society. The state's identity as part of the Bible Belt cemented religion's role in shaping not just personal lives, but the very governance of communities. Churches weren't just places of worship, they were rallying points during the civil rights movement, centers of social life, and the moral backbone during times of war. It's also important to note that North Carolina's conservative political atmosphere strengthens religious adherence as laws and values often reflect Christian teachings. Number nine, Oklahoma is a place where the frontier spirit and faith are inseparable. Did you know that 75% of Oklahomans identify as religious? With 43% attending church weekly, evangelical Protestants make up 47% of the population, followed by 19% mainline Protestants and 8% Catholics. But that's not all. Other religions, including Judaism, Islam, and Buddhism, account for about 3% of the religious makeup, showing that Oklahoma's faith landscape is diverse, yet deeply Christian. Religion here is tightly woven into Oklahoma's pioneer history. When settlers arrived in the harsh, untamed lands of the American frontier, it was their faith that gave them hope. Churches weren't just places for prayer. They were lifelines, providing food, shelter, and a sense of community when life was tough. The government, too, has played a role in supporting religious values. Many laws on marriage, education, and even business are influenced by Christian beliefs. Even today in small towns, church bells are a signal that the heart of Oklahoma still beats with a strong faith. Number 8. Georgia In Georgia, religion isn't just a Sunday affair, it's a lifestyle. Did you know 76% of Georgians are religious, with 45% attending church weekly? Evangelical Protestants make up the largest group at 38% with mainline Protestants at 15% and 10% of the population is Catholic. Yet other religions such as Islam, Judaism, and Hinduism make up 3%, proving that faith in Georgia, while predominantly Christian, has a growing diversity. The story of Georgia's devotion is deeply rooted in its Bible Belt identity. Faith has shaped Georgia since its founding, with religion guiding settlers through struggles with Native American tribes, the Civil War, and later civil rights battles. Churches in Georgia were central to the civil rights movement, with leaders like Dr. Martin Luther King preaching equality and justice from the pulpit. The state's governance has always leaned toward Christian conservatism, with lawmakers enacting policies in education, health care, and social services that reflect religious values. Here, faith is more than a belief, it's a call to action. Number 7. West Virginia Did you know that in the mountainous state of West Virginia, 77% of people identify as religious, with a staggering 48% attending church weekly. Evangelical Protestants lead with 41%, followed by mainline Protestants at 18%, and Catholics at 5%. Surprisingly, there's also a small but significant presence of other faiths like Islam, Judaism, and Hinduism, making up 1% of the population. Why so religious? West Virginia's rugged, isolated geography meant that settlers relied heavily on their faith to survive. In these remote mountain communities, churches became essential lifelines, places not only of worship, but of social gathering and survival support. Throughout history, West Virginia has faced economic hardship, from mining accidents to job losses. 
And in these moments of crisis, faith has been a constant source of strength. The state's governance also supports religious adherence, with education policies encouraging the teaching of Christian values in schools and a strong pro-life stance aligning with religious teachings. Number six, South Carolina. In South Carolina, religion isn't just a belief, it's a way of life. With 79% of its population identifying as religious and 50% attending church weekly, the state's religious makeup consists of 40% evangelical Protestants, 15% mainline Protestants, and 8% Catholics. Other religions like Judaism and Islam make up a modest 2%, but their presence is growing in urban areas like Charleston. Why is South Carolina so steeped in faith? Its history is a testament to religious perseverance. From the first European settlers who brought Christianity to its shores to the Civil War, where churches played critical roles as places of refuge, religion has always guided the moral compass of South Carolina. The government reflects this religious culture, with lawmakers regularly supporting policies that align with Christian values. Even the state's stance on issues like abortion and marriage is heavily influenced by religious beliefs. Number five, Arkansas. In Arkansas, the fusion of faith and tradition is almost sacred. 81% of Arkansans identify as religious, and an impressive 53% attend church weekly. Evangelical Protestants dominate the scene with 43%, followed by 18% mainline Protestants and 6% Catholics. About 3% of the population adheres to other religions such as Islam, Judaism, and Buddhism, showing a small yet vibrant diversity. The story of Arkansas's devotion to faith goes back to the earliest settlers, who braved the wild rural terrain with only their faith as their guide. Churches quickly became more than just places of worship. They were the epicenters of community life, education, and social assistance. This deep-seated religious culture continues today, with state laws often mirroring Christian teachings, from education to family values. Arkansas's faith-based governance isn't just about policy, it's about preserving a way of life where church and state walk hand in hand. Number four, Louisiana. Did you know that 83% of Louisiana's population identifies as religious, with an impressive 56% attending church weekly? Unlike most other southern states, Louisiana has a unique religious landscape, with 28% of its population identifying as Catholic, largely due to its French and Spanish heritage. Evangelical Protestants make up 33%, while 9% follow mainline Protestant traditions. The state also has a fascinating mix of other faiths. About 3% practice voodoo, Islam, Judaism, and Buddhism, adding to Louisiana's rich spiritual tapestry. Louisiana's religious identity is as colorful and diverse as its cultural history. From the Catholic traditions brought by French settlers to the mystical practices of voodoo introduced by enslaved Africans, faith in Louisiana is a fusion of old world beliefs and new world spirituality. In the aftermath of Hurricane Katrina, churches across Louisiana provided hope, shelter, and unity for the displaced. The government's relationship with religion is also prominent, especially in rural areas where local laws often reflect the state's deep Catholic roots. Number three, Tennessee. In Tennessee, faith is the cornerstone of life. 85% of the population identifies as religious, with a remarkable 60% attending church weekly. Evangelical Protestants dominate at 52%, followed by 14% mainline Protestants and 5% Catholics. Other religions, including Islam, Judaism, and Buddhism, make up about 2% of the population, particularly in growing urban centers like Nashville. Tennessee's religious fervor dates back to its early days, where faith was not just a belief, but a way of surviving the harsh wilderness. As part of the Bible Belt, Tennessee's churches have long been the foundation of community life. Faith played a crucial role during the civil rights movement, with churches often serving as the meeting grounds for activists. The state's conservative government has supported faith-based initiatives in education, healthcare, and social policies, ensuring that religious values are closely tied to the fabric of Tennessee's laws and culture. Number two, Alabama. Did you know that 87% of Alabama's population identifies as religious? With 61% attending church weekly, this state takes its faith seriously. 51% of Alabamians are evangelical Protestants, followed by 10% mainline Protestants, 6% Catholics, and a smaller 3% following other religions like Islam and Judaism. Alabama's deep religious roots stretch back to its antebellum history. Churches were the moral backbone during slavery, the Civil War, and the turbulent days of the Civil Rights Movement. 
Religious leaders here wield significant influence in politics, particularly on issues like abortion and same-sex marriage, where conservative Christian values are often reflected in state law. In Alabama, religion is more than a belief. It's a social structure that guides everyday life from community events to political policies. Number one, Mississippi. Welcome to Mississippi, the most religious state in America, where a staggering 89% of the population identifies as religious and 65% attend church weekly. Evangelical Protestants dominate with 61%, followed by 13% mainline Protestants and 4% Catholics. But here's something you may not know. 2% of Mississippi's population practices Islam, Judaism, and other non-Christian faiths, giving this highly Christian state a small yet notable religious diversity. Mississippi's history of faith is interwoven with its struggles and triumphs. From the days of slavery, through the Civil War, to the fight for civil rights, churches were not just spiritual centers, but safe havens for the oppressed. Today, the church continues to play a vital role in community life and Mississippi's government often reflects this influence with conservative laws that align with Christian values, particularly on issues like abortion, school prayer, and family values. Mississippi isn't just the most religious state in America, it's the soul of the nation's faith. There you have it, the top 10 most religious states in America for 2024. From the churches of Mississippi to the mountains of West Virginia, faith continues to be a powerful force shaping lives, communities, and even politics. So, what do you think? Is your state on the list? Make sure to like, subscribe, and drop a comment below about your thoughts on religion in America today. Thanks for watching, 